happy Wednesday. So let me go ahead and show y'all what I'm gonna be doing um, on the side today for a side, nice meal. This is what I'm gonna be eating. My Berea sandwiches, I'm just gonna prepare one right now for lunch. And then I could do some uh, sweet potato fries as well. But what I'm gonna do is just open this like this. And then um, take some of the um, steak, English roast steak, bread buns, steak, steak meat. Since this is my, since this is my first meal, I'm not doing any lines, but I want to show y'all how I make my own bur burria sandwich. Okay, so I have it just like this. The bread is frozen. The meat is not frozen, but the meat kind of looks like this because it does come together with the um you know the liquid and everything in the refrigerator so it just changes the texture changes once you heat up something i heated this up yesterday i try not to heat it up too much but this is look at that i left my tacos at work but that's okay because i have a beautiful burrito sandwich and i don't have to add um anything to it so what i'm gonna do is just put this in the microwave actually that's that and then i can have air fried like an air fried or take out potato so i have enough of that because i will not be cooking i'll be eating um any meal i'll be eating any meal as leftovers so let me be careful so this is what I'll be having also for lunch a little bit of sweet potato so I want to cut the sweet potato up just to see how it's going to be so it's going to be sweet potato fries in the air fryer and a little bit of the sandwich for me I hope everybody's having a lovely Wednesday I can't believe it's Wednesday but just like that and then I have to get a copper knife to cut it up. So let me move this over there. Let's see. There you go. This is a really big sweet potato. One side, one side. Hopefully everybody's having a good day. <laughs> having a good day as far as work, work wise. Just trying to get some things out of the way. Move that. Try to take the skin off at least because I want to check the potato. Rinse the potato off, and then you can rinse it off again, and just check and make sure it's okay. Um, the main goal of this is just making sure it ain't no rotten pieces. Fruit and vegetables go bad so quickly, so I'll leave my sweet potato in the uh, refrigerator. I like to leave a lot of stuff in the fridge, just to be sure. Let me push that down. There we go. Right. there we go so i also like to cut them up you can cut them into cubes and I, because this one's really sweet i don't put sugar let me cook this side if you have a potato pillar that'll be cool too but just gives me a little extra time to do something a nice quick dinner healthy lunch you can use regular fries too nothing wrong with that let me go ahead and cut up this sweet potato. Oh, this part right here. And children would love sweet potato fries. I love sweet potato fries. I'm grown. I'm pretty sure kids will love it because it's sweet. So, push that down a little. Just, like I told you guys, I'm giving you videos today. And that's the best I can do. I don't feel like going live. I've been going live for the last four months i'm going to take a little mini break okay here we go you can see how nice and thick these fries are looking Ooh, they look really good so right here you just take a little go down this part right here you cut in between and then here you just go down you get the gist of it see potato fries that's how it looks. Sweet potato is so good for you. I think it's uh, vitamin K and other things. I'm pretty sure if you're not sick, 
still has benefits for you. If you feel in the way I do, it can benefit me. So this is, I'm gonna throw away a lot of this and I'm show you how I season it. So what are you having for lunch? This is my lunch today. This is a big sweet potato. That's my lunch. And this is my dinner. I know some of y'all probably miss me going live, but I'm going to be back live on Friday. Right? It's a lot of good lives to come. To come. I need to start planning content. Leave that right there. You can make the fries six or ten, depending on how you want them. And you can also make cubes. So I'm going to prepare the air fryer. Show you what I use. I I like to use I like to use the Kinder caramelized onion butter. I like to use the grapeseed oil. So I just put a little oil on the fries. Doesn't take long. You can just put this in the oven um, if you want oven or air fried sweet potato fries either one's your preference let me get the air fryer together and kind of rub these on here the oil is going to help it to stay i usually put a little paprika but because i'm not feeling like all of that i just want to prepare a nice healthy go-to meal just to sit down nice healthy easy and keep it moving. Like girl dad stay. Like girl dad always says, what he says, stay in motion. I like that. So positive, you know? So, thank you. Again, like and subscribe. I'm gonna put this in the um, air fryer for 15 minutes and prepare the oven. Let me show you how my sandwich is looking. I don't know where I put my little little air frying thing. My my hands off real good. And I'm going to cut the rest later for dinner or now off camera. Thank you and I'll show you the end result of the meal.